Hey Queens, welcome back to my channel. It's Asia and C here. I hope you guys are having a great day so far. So I'm back finally. Sorry guys for that one week hiatus, but I was at Disneyland um, for my band trip. And yeah, I'm back now and I wanted to uh, film a video. So I decided, hey, let's do like another tutorial or mod review. So I decided to do the MC Command Center for The Sims 4. This is honestly one of my top favorite mods like ever created. I'll definitely leave like all the links down in the description for you guys. So yeah, um, this mod is super handy. Like, you know, like if you want to cheat like your Sims career or your Sims moon, yeah, you can do testing cheats true, but you know, or you can like, um, there's done, there's tons of like things you can do with this mod. So I'll like, I'll show you guys when we get in game, but yeah, I'll definitely leave the website down in the description and yeah. So you definitely want, um, to go to, um, well, I cannot talk today. <laughs> you definitely want to download the most recent one, the updated version. So yes, once you click on here. So you definitely want to download the most recent version of the MC Command Center. So for me is the MC Command Center 6.0.1. So like I clicked that already and it already downloaded, but here, let me, okay. So, oh, there's another one downloaded. So basically just click this link and then um, the lower tab, I have a Windows. So if you have a Mac or anything else, it's probably gonna be different. I'm sorry, but yeah. <laughs> so we're gonna click show in folder once it's fully downloaded. And yeah, I downloaded it twice. So it <laughs> appeared in my folder twice. So you definitely want to either cut or copy. I like to cut, I don't know why. But yeah, <laughs> so you want to go to your Sims um, 4 mods folder. If you don't know where to find that, you go to documents, hit electronic arts, and then the Sims 4, and then go to mods, and then yeah. So I already made a folder for the MC command mod, because I like all of my mods to be organized, but if you don't, you know, you don't personally have to do that, you can just place it all in your mods folder. So yeah, so click, and well, I'm gonna click clearly. <laughs> so once I clicked, I go to paste and I'm gonna paste it in and also you need WinWar to or something to extract it with so um, I use ultimate zip and then I can extract here and then it should take a couple seconds but um, I'll probably leave um, the link for WinWar down in the description so you guys can um, hopefully extract it yeah so it's all here and yeah so i think we're just gonna hop in game and i'll see you guys when we're in game and we have valerie from last video so she's gonna be a model for our video and right now she um she's looking like a stinky hot mess so we're gonna fix that <laughs> So, um, once you have the mod downloaded, just click on her, and you should see this tab saying MC Command Center, so click on that, and this sh menu should pop up, and it should have a description, Valerie Lou, you know, so many, okay. So, there's modify, household, and create a sim, MC, you know, cast, so that's like cast sheets, so you can like set appearance randomized appearance bo set body set walk copy and paste set physique change personality traits that's really kind of handy um so there's the mc cheats which you can increase the sims household's funds sims sheets including set skills to max or set any skill i guess and we can change their mood increase points make happy so we're gonna make her happy, yes. And we can abduct sim or reset the sim. Um, there's MC dresser, change your outfit, you know, clothing. Then MC pregnancy, which I really don't know because my sim's not pregnant, so like I really don't play with that option that much. So yeah, there's the MC her, which I really don't play with that either. Um, MC Flags, I really don't know what that is either. I guess it's like MC Career. Okay, okay, there's some options. But yeah, you definitely want to play around with the options. 
So there's Sims commands. You can modify and create a Sim, set age, rename Sim, delete Sim, kill Sim. For everyone, forget active, analyze Sim, turn into a vampire. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we can edit relationships. So let's see, let's see. We can set an active relationship for sure, this lot. Female, um, friendly, let's see, let's do good friends. And then I'm pretty sure everyone in this house that is a female, yeah. See, Katrina just became good friends with Valerie, yeah. So, oh wow, that's a lot of, okay. <laughs> and anyways, we can't really help her saying, I think there was a fire that happened. So, she's, she has to clean herself. Um, oh god, this house is crusty dusty. Okay, it's fine, let Okay guys, so that's pretty much it for the mod review. I hope you guys like. I'm sorry that I didn't really go in depth, but I just gave you guys the overall, you know, options, I guess. You know, it's really self-explanatory. And yeah, I highly recommend it because it helps me a lot because like, you know, when I want to edit like a Sims career, it's like, ugh, I don't know like what the cheat is, like, you know, control shift C and like type it all out. Like, no girl, I don't have time for that. So this mod definitely helps. So yeah, I highly recommend it. And yeah, um, I definitely want to do more tutorials and mod reviews. So if you guys have any um, recommendations or just videos you won't want me to do leave it down in the comments and yeah um i'll see you guys next time brand new video also follow me on twitter at asia z if you guys want to talk hit me up and yeah i'll see you guys next time with a brand new video bye